How about a little fun? And the North Valley Merced County Fair is kicking off today. CBS 47's Fabiola Ramirez is there live this morning with a look at all the fun going on at the fair. What have you found this time? Hey, Joey. So, really cool things, actually. UC Merced students are here showing kids how science works through games. Very interesting. Now, I have Ken here with me this morning. Talk to us about, first of all, what are these kids doing over here? So this is our sustainability game. This is one of the, uh, some of the games that we're going to be having in our mobile maker space, which is going to be unveiled early next year. So this is really an innovative STEM hub where students, we're really providing access for students who maybe don't get to experience STEM in their classrooms, get access to higher education. And these are some of the games that will, will be part of that. So it's basically you're learning science through Basically, fun games. What is this kid right here doing with us? So, this is the scribble bot. He's basically becoming his own Picasso here. This robot helps draw these different types with these uh, markers, draw different types of things. It's kind of a fun way to, to get into art uh, with science using a robot. Wow, that's really cool. And here we have a picture of the mobile maker space. You said you guys are going to unveil it next year. It's basically a mobile truck that goes around and has all these different games and activities for kids, correct? Yes, and that's the goal is to take this across the Central Valley to community events, to fairs, to schools during the school year and give access again to these types of activities and STEM that maybe some of these places don't get that regularly. Yeah, and I think the cool part too is that young kids are able to do different activities, learn different things when it comes to science. What do we have here? So these are paper circuits, basically making light use, with the use of copper wire and paper. It's, it's very simple, but it is access to something that, you know, is fun, making light and uh, creating energy through just paper. And I think the coolest part here is we have these young girls over here who are learning how to use a drone. That's amazing. You ready for that? Is this fun? Here, let's have you turn to the camera real quick. Tell us what you're doing. I'm flying a drone. You're flying a drone? How cool is that? Cool. Cool, right? All right, let's check you out doing it. Go for it. All right, tell us a little bit about this. I mean, a kid is doing it, so yes. I, I feel a little embarrassed. I don't even know how to fly a drone. <laughs> well, this is part of it. It is showing this is maybe something that is easy to, to pick up and go, learn how to fly a drone. This is obviously a growing field. It is something that falls under STEM and is exciting for kids uh, to, to be able to fly something that maybe they've seen on TV or in the movies. Yeah, yeah. It looks like she's having a little bit of trouble right now, but they're getting her. Oh, there we go. Oh. She got it going. Wow, this is amazing. Um, anything you'd like to add about just UC Merced taking on the initiative to try to get all these kids to learn new things and actually get excited about STEM? Well, one important thing is uh, with the support of Mike and Lori Gallo and the UC Merced Foundation, this has been possible. This is something we've wanted to do for a while. And again, it's, it's really not just making people come to UC Merced to experience this, but being able to take it to them is something that we feel is very important in our mission. Wonderful. Lastly, where can they find you here at the fair? So we are in the San Joaquin Hall. Uh, it is the Discovering Science exhibit, and we will be here 5 to 9 uh, all throughout the fair. Wonderful. All right, John, I'm going to send it back to you. We're going to get that drone unstuck because <laughs> it got stuck towards the end. Uh-oh. <laughs> Never know what's going to happen over there. By the way, that hall, folks, if you're thinking it's too hot, there'll be an AC running later on this afternoon at the fair so you can seek shelter.